Hey, what's going on my Steelers fans? Welcome back to another video. As always, please like, comment, and subscribe as I am only four subscribers away from 400. So let's get that done. But obviously a few things to talk about. One being the game yesterday that ended in a tie against the Detroit Lions, which was not good. Um, you know, it was definitely a trap game. We should have still won that. Too many fumbles in overtime uh, was one of the main reasons why we lost that game. Uh, Rudolph just wasn't really hitting his targets. He was floating the ball a lot. Uh, forcing way too many passes, bad play calls from Matt Canada. It's you're on the five yard line, first down, and you pass three times. Horrible play calling. Um, other than that, injuries, injuries just keep adding up. Uh, luckily, you know, T.J. Watt is expected to only be out at least a week or two with a knee and hip injury. So you know, definitely got pretty lucky with that as well as uh, Doxon's also going to be out. He might be going on a short-term IR. They aren't sure about that yet, but he could be missing a couple weeks. And just recently, Minka Fitzpatrick just tested positive for COVID. So now he's probably going to be out next week too. So, you know, it just, everything's going downhill at this point. But <clears throat> it is what it is. We're 5-3-1, and one, second place in a division. Just got to keep winning these tough games. We got a tough game next week against the Chargers Sunday night. Got to play them tough. They're a hungry team right now, and the Chargers are coming off a loss. We're coming off of a tie. Hopefully, we get Ben back. Hopefully, we get Claypool back um, because they're, they're going to be needed. Definitely going to be needed, but it is what it is. Next guy, next man up. That's how it's got to be, next man up mentality. Listen, Rudolph didn't play as bad um, as I'm sure a lot of people thought he was going to. Got to give him props for it, but very sloppy game. Very hard game for him to play in uh, for his first time in two years. So you, you got to give him the benefit of the doubt. But defense needs to stop that run game. If we stop that run game, we, we blow him out. We blow him out. But it is what it is. Steelers tied the line 16-16. to 16, And uh, just got to move on to next week. So here we go, Steelers. As always, please like, comment, and subscribe.